Jack's Christian faith landed him in trouble with the law. His crime? Adhering to his biblical belief that marriage is between one man and one woman. Shut up! Before it's too late. Shut it! We can all be saved Shut tonight. Up. And I pray that you turn and repent before Get it's too late. Head. Turn Get from it. your sin. Blah, 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 blah. What blah, is blah, sin? Blah, blah, blah. The Civil Rights Commission's order requires Jack and his staff to make cakes for same-sex celebrations if asked. He must also re-educate his staff about Colorado's Anti-Discrimination Act. Under that law, artists must endorse all views. The order also requires him to put in place new policies to comply with the commission's order. Get off that mic and go away from here right now, or I'll make this nation rise against you. Do you understand me? Do you each and every one you understand me? Don't play with the God that runs this earth. Back away. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you why. Okay, so we see that. That's what they call assault. According to the legal system, that's an assault. That's an assault. What did I say to you? It's surprising. Um, yeah, this is not what they taught us in civics class. They could do this to you, they do this in other countries, not here. So Jack stands on the First Amendment. In this case, we're going to learn whether the First Amendment has a future in America. And in a country founded on freedom of religion and speech, that's a future important to all Americans.